What's going on, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, back at Game of the Back video. Today, we're going to get into I Think You Freaky by Die Antword. I don't know, uh, 11 years ago, this is mad old, but it's got 187 million views. That's crazy. So, shout out to Neek for recommending this, uh, the homie Neek. Now, Die Antword, I've heard of Die Antword. Uh, I think they were beefing with the main guy. I think there's two of them. It's a, a guy and a girl, and I think the main guy was beefing with, like, a DJ, a popular DJ, Diplo, or... Kanye or somebody, dude. I remember hearing something about that a few years ago in the news or like the the online Twitter, YouTube news. You know what I mean? The uh, people that cover that stuff. So I don't know what to expect, to be honest, but we're going to jump right into it. Hope you're having a good day. Come vibe with your boy. This better be good, Neek. on the wall that was crazy This is some, some different. Okay, okay, uh, Neek, you're banned from recommendations, brother. <laughs> uh, no, I'm just playing. Um, this was definitely a bit of a kind of shock value 
record. And I don't I don't think it's necessarily about the sound as much as the visuals. The visuals are definitely more shock value than the sound. The sound has a little bit more of that trance, techno, EDM kind of vibe that, you know, you would hear at a festival or like European club kind of thing. You know what I mean? It's definitely more in that genre. And it's not too crazy. The lyrics might be. There's a lot of lyrics I didn't really catch, especially with the, the female on here. Her high vocals got lost a little bit in the mix, and it was hard to understand her. The guy I could understand a little bit better. Um, I liked his part better because the the vocal tone of it sounded better, but also the the way the beat kind of like was increasing in BPM was pretty cool too. That was that was different, and he was rapping, and it was like very catchy, to be honest. Even though it was really weird, it was really catchy as it was speeding up, and he's rapping, and the beat's coming in, and then it drops, and then it goes back into the I Find You Freaky, and I Like You A Lot. That... It actually kind of, at that point, grew on me a little bit. Now, the song, overall, this isn't really my vibe. Um, I like EDM music, but I'm pretty specific with it. I know, I'm not really a fan of like the trap style, the hard style, the, uh, the this kind of techno, high-energy high techno stuff. It's very, very like uh, cocaine-fueled music. You know, I'm not really the biggest fan of it. However... If I heard this in a concert setting, in a festival setting, it probably would go hard and I probably would vibe with it, but that's the only time. Any other time I'm listening to this, I just, I can't really listen to it, you know? Uh, it's it's something about it is just a little bit abrasive. I think it's a lot of the synths in here that, you know, are higher pitched and not the smoothest to the ears. It's not a bad song. You know, it's just very different. I like the composition of it. I like the way it was structured. I think it had a good structure, and it definitely had a good pace all the way through. Um, there was a little bit of a push-pull towards the middle and towards the end, but it ramped up, and I think they did a good job. Like, I could imagine this at a festival being a really, really banger of a song. Now, the visuals. I don't know what it in the Lady Gaga meets Satan meets uh, borderline racism is going on here. I don't know. There was some, there was some weird imagery in here. There was some provocative imagery in here there was some questionable imagery in here i don't know what to think about the video i don't know where these people from i think my brain somewhere in the files of my memory is telling me that they're south african i believe is where they're from could be way off on that but my brain is telling me that but the visuals i don't know they're they're a hybrid of like creepy and goofy and Almost, not, I mean, not all the way satanic, but a little bit of some evil vibes going on. I don't know, you know, some of that imagery is kind of weird and uh, dark, but I don't know. I don't know. Would I check more of them out? Absolutely. They are captivating off of the first introduction to them. There is something magnetic about them. Like, I, I can't look away, and it's not necessarily a good thing, but... It definitely makes me want to check out more of their music because this is a very, very unique sounding song, I think. So I would check out more if you guys want me to. Um, I'm not opposed because this song's not bad. It's just not for me. It's just very, very different, you know. There's a few songs that I've reacted to where I'm like, it's just not good. It's messy. It's, it doesn't sound good. It's it's off BPM a little bit. The key is not in key. You know, things like that where you, you can kind of say it's not good, but... I'm not getting that here. I'm just getting a whole bunch of weirdness, so I don't know. If you have any more, Neek, you want me to check out, let me know. But uh, if you guys are fans of Die Ant Word, I want to say Die Ant Wood, but Die Ant Word, um, and there's some songs you want me to check out, let me know for sure. So that'll do it for today's direction video. Hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, leave a like, leave a comment down below. It helps the channel grow. It helps the YouTube algorithm. If you're new here and you haven't done so, hit that subscribe button. I drop a video every day. If you're not new here, welcome back. Appreciate the love and support as always. Thank you very much for showing up and showing love. You know what to do. Leave some comments down below. What do you think about this? Have you ever heard this? Do you know these people, know of them, know of their music? If not, and you're like me, what just happened? Let me know your thoughts and opinions. If there's anything I missed in there, I don't know. I feel like maybe there's some cryptic things going on in the video. Maybe they connect the dots with other songs they've done or projects. I don't know. Y'all let me know. If you're a fan of Die Ant Word, be sure to support Die Ant Word. Always support the band, the artist, the YouTuber, the entertainer, whoever's making content and music for you. Support that person. So with all that being said, hope you're having a great day. Send a positive vibes your win. Until next time, I'm out.